The Mobile World Congress is where innovators from OEMs, the software side of things, and the core hardware manufacturers present their latest offerings. Broadcom was one such company that we got to spend some time with. From the Internet of Things, wearables, democratization of LTE, to mesh-based communication, the company is clearly leveraging its expertise in wireless technology to make tangible improvements across verticals. Let's start off with the Internet of Things then. As the name suggests, IoT aims at connecting the unconnected, and creating a common platform for daily use devices to speak to each other. This can be as simple as the Nest thermostat that you can control over the internet, smart scales that keep a log of weight fluctuations, to smarter wearables that will be able to provide intrinsic metrics, which when paired with smarter software will work towards enabling a healthier lifestyle. Broadcom's Wicked platform is one of the many offerings that aims to create a reference platform for hardware and software providers to hook into. Wicket stands for Wireless for Internet Connected Embedded Devices. The Wicket platform combines GPS, NFC, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and provides a common architecture with a sensor hub that integrates inputs for on-chip algorithms. These algorithms can not only detect and compute speed, distance travelled but also context. The architecture is aimed at always-on devices like wearables, health and fitness monitors amongst others. Broadcom's new BCM4771 GNSS SOC that has the on-chip sensor hub that delivers precise metrics for location data and activity tracking is an integral part of the Wicket platform. Broadcom's expertise lies in wireless chips and making use of it is the new mesh-based communication solution. The wireless mesh lets data hop from one device to another till it reaches the desired recipient. Using this, you can make operator-free voice calls, messages, data transfers for free between your own group. The BCM4771 chip was another important part of Broadcom's showcase at MWC. The new GNSS SOC is aimed at wearables to provide better and more detailed information. Not only can these track users via GPS, but due to reductions in die size, also offers much improved battery life. The combination of hardware innovations across the wearables, GNSS and wireless space made Broadcom one of the more interesting players at MWC. And we really can't wait for OEMs to bring out products based on the latest in wireless tech. Watch out for Samsung's Galaxy Core LTE and the new Gear 2, both of which are powered by Broadcom's technology under the hood. This was Dhruv Bhutani from Phonearena.com. If you enjoyed the video, please do hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.